Hello everybody, it is I, Sakamoto, here back at it again with more Delta Room. This time we're playing chapter two. Uh Yeah. Let's just get right into it. Chapter two, episode one. Alright. Chris? Chris, honey? Are you awake? Wait! Is that a... A knife? No! What the hell's happening? Chris, did you eat all the pie? <laughs> Face bomb. It is your knife in this empty tin, is it not? Oh, Chris, am I going to have to lock the oven again? <laughs> well, hurry out of bed. It is time for school. Okie dokie, Mom. You got it. Uh, no, that's okay. Even after a long night, the sun rises the same as always. Wait, where's all my money? Did I have a crap load? Maybe I spent it all. Make it tempting to take my brother's money now, but it's okay, I don't need it. I know we'll get more when we go and fight more monsters and whatever else we're doing. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting this is the bathroom. I keep thinking this is the mom's room for some reason, but the mom's room is over here. Eh, whatever. Probably just a bunch of snail books like her room over in, uh, Undertale, and you know, whatever else was there. Wasn't it like snail pun jokes and stuff? And, or no, no, there was a, there was a, he's feeling, bo he was feeling bonely joke, I think. There was a, there was a skeleton pun she was writing down to probably, you know, have an improv fun time, funny situation with Sans. Anyway, back to the game. Well, shall we go? Yay, I'm in class again. Chris, there you are. You and Susie showed up before me. Yeah. Hey, Chris! If I knew you were gonna be late, I would have showed up on I wouldn't have showed up on time. Susie, please don't kick your desk. Treat school properly like you treat people. Okay, next time I'll aim for the waddle. <laughs> but, but that's not what I... In any case, good morning, class. We have a lot to cover today. First, we're starting to the reading from page 142. Any volunteers? <laughs> um, I guess I could read that. Ah, trouble yourself not, Noel. I will valiantly take this blow of humiliation. Um, that's okay. I can... Ahem. Page 142. It was the best times. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. Times are pretty good. Times are pretty bad. Mediocre times. Iffy times. Social times. Listening to this, your eyes begin to close automatically. Have a nice day, everyone. And please remember your group projects. Oh, um, Chris, are you okay? You're um, sleeping all class. Don't worry, I'm not mad, it's just as concerned. Usually you only sleep at the start. Good luck and rest well tonight, okay? Excuse me. Oh, it has some more in there. Excuse me. Oh crap, I wanted to talk to Alphys again. Well, look who it is. The school zombie. You are sleeping like a corpse all class. <laughs> What's the matter? Had trouble going Betty by last night? Me too, Chris. Like I could sleep after yesterday. Just waiting for today felt like years. Did all that stuff really happen? Lancer, Relsei, everyone. Are they still... Look. Been wondering the same thing, right? Come on already! Uh, 
Alright, Chris, this is it. Home of truth. Yeah. Everything we've been waiting for is just behind this. Yeah. If we uh, open this and there's nothing inside, yeah. well, uh, we still be. Yeah. Screw it. Let's just open it already. <laughs> oh, Susie? Yeah. yeah? Hello. Hey. Yeah. What the hell are you doing here? Oh, I'm sorry to bother you, but, um, I. Well, I just. Bertha and I were going to the library to do some research for our group project, and if it's okay, um, would you want to come too? Oh, yes, you would love to, I mean. Uh, I mean. We're like, uh, busy with, uh. Chris, help me out here. What do I say? Hanging out in the alone in the closet. Crime. Oh no! <laughs> Both of these are really bad. What do I do? Fuck it. I'm gonna say... The first one. Y you know, just chilling out alone in the closet. Just, just two friends chilling out in the closet like normal. Touching brooms and stuff. Uh, oh, um, well, uh, that sounds, um, just... Well, fun, you too. I'll be, I'll um, be at the library. Chris, if you could bring a pie later, it would mean a lot to me. Um, actually, wait, wait a second, Sudi, I, um, I have something for you. Okay, see you, bye. Question mark? It's a lunchbox? Full of chalk? She had chalk the whole time? You didn't give it to Alphys? What the hell, Chris? Here, you hold on to this. You got the chalk. Wait, Chris, what the hell was that? Why would Noelle ask me to do homework with her? Death Witch much? Does she want to fail? Wait a second. Wait a second. Chris, did you notice how nervous she was? And, like, blushing and stuff? Chris, you don't think she, uh... She's onto our secret identities? You know, this Dark World stuff. Damn, we gotta keep this under wraps, Chris. This is our thing, you know? Anyway, enough waiting already, right? Let's go! Holy shitballs. Okay, this is cool as fuck. Whoa. Frickin' rad, bruh. Oh, and we're moving already. Do I still have auto run turned on? Okay, good. My controller's still not working. I don't even know if it would work because it was unplugged a little bit ago. But whatever. We are. Chris, Susie, it's been ever so long. Yeah, it's been, what, a day? Oh, that is short, isn't it? It's just that I've never had friends before. So I've never waited so long to see them either. Fine, guess we'll try not to let you die of loneliness. I bet Lancer wants to see us too, right? Hey, wait a sec. Where is Lancer? Where's everybody? Worry not, Susie. We'll see them in a moment. Just wait here, all right? Okay. Hey, this better not be some kind of prank or something. Bruce, I have something to ask you. I need you to return to the light world. And go to the old classroom to the east of the closet doors. Inside, gather everything on the ground. Bring it back here, could you? Okay, sure. BRB. Where'd they say to go? East? I guess that's this way. You gathered all the junk off the floor. And turn it into a giant dusty ball. Uh okay. Now I got a bunch of stuff on my head. Uh that uh that just happened. Hey Chris, so where is every one? Guess who's back, clowns? 
Spencer! High five. <laughs> hey, Chris, don't know what you did, but hell yeah! Everyone's here! But, uh, what happened to, uh, Lancer's castle? All gone! Huh? What? When Chris sealed the fountain, that dark world disappeared and turned back into a normal classroom. So, where's Lancer gonna live now? Don't worry, Susie. We'll conquer Ralphie's castle as our own. Bruce, as you bring Dark World denizens back here, the power of our fountain will transform this town more and more. From now on, the enemies we spare will be recruited to our town. So let's keep sparing enemies, okay? Anyhow, why don't we all have a look around? We can head north towards the castle. I have a special surprise to show you there. Ha <laughs> not if I surprise myself first. This one there is a fresh and fragrant egg! Come on, Chris, you gotta, you gotta let him beat us? Oh, okay. Sorry, I had to look something up real quick. Um, oh, welcome to Sakamoto Town. Or so I heard it's called. Hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's where I want to live, Sakamoto Town. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> or am I? I don't know. Seems like Hathi likes this place. She hopes you like it too. Mamma me, but welcome to Top Bakery. Our special chef spin baked goods at the top of their class. Alright. Oh, how did I do his voice again? Sorry. Oh, thou hast transplanted a Astaline Castle Town. And truly. Oh god, wait. And truly a magnific magnificent town of castles, it's art. But whole, oh, hmm. Something odd lacking, if it feeleth. Perhaps our guys, perhaps bring in a new ruler or something. This is the party dojo. <sighs> Thanks to you, com Commander, we've been liberated. I hereby declare today National Ham Sandwich Day of Independence. Cool. This guy always seems like he's enjoying life more than me. Is because he's a higher level. Oh ho ho! I am Chef Lancer, trying my delicious hand-warmed cookies. They're free for a price. A cookie. You already took a cookie. Wait, I'm still regenerating from the last one. Okay. Oh, well, welcome to Top Bakery. I am Miss Bakery Smith, Malleus. I do not know what any of these strange tools are for, but using my skills, I can fuse items to create new ones. Uh. Interesting. Okay. I was wondering what that was about when a bullet almost hits you but doesn't lower your HP and there's this white glow around the heart. I guess that's what that is. Oh, you get tension points when that happens. I'm, I'm guessing. I mean, you get tension points when you get hit and lose HP either way, so. 
Alright, we've got Twisted Sword, a Strange Blade. Short Ribbons, you'll have to cut your hair into pigtails. A black wristband covered in spikes has a tendency to get stuck to itself. A square charm that increases dropped money by 5%. It's the Double Dark Burger. It takes two bites to finish. Alright. That sounds interesting. Well, I need the ingredients, so I'll go get two dark thingamajiggies. Oh, I do have a bunch of money. Okay. So the money in this world equals two dollars, or in the other world, or maybe, I don't know, whatever. Oh, look, a save point. Cool. The castle town is transformed from the power of friendship. You are filled with the power of friendship-based architecture. Sweet. Storage. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Feels one HP, that's it. What the heck? Okay, because we're on chapter two, everything's all different. We got info for everybody in the town. Interesting. Okay, and we can either do this, or press left and right here. Rudin, said to be someone's best friend, but maybe not. Shine on, you lazy diamond. Kathy, a heart with a big heart, always supporting others with her bullets. Pond Man, a simple organism that takes life one square at a time. Rabbit, a real dust bunny, known to play dirty but loves to play clean. Bloxer, a shape-changing fighter, ironically blocking is not its forte. Jigsaw, a cries tears of joy that you are its boss. Rudin Ranger, obsessed with ranger shows, it lets everyone know it's better than human. Interesting. It's a manual. Read a topic. Yeah, let's read about it. If you spare, if you spare pacify enough enemies of the same type, they will be recruited. Recruits will appear in your town. Wonder what happens if you get them all. You can check the area's recruit status at save points. Certain bosses are excluded. Okay. Okay. Alright, the storage. You will now have access to a storage menu of save points. When you're out, instead of having a separate box like an Undertale, that's an improvement. That's cool. Uh, but in Undertale, you do get the dimensional phone, which renders the boxes useless later on. So maybe you get something similar to that in this. I don't know, we'll see. When you're out of space, items will you find or buy will be sent to your storage. Now that's what I'm talking about. Feel free to put things inside you might not be able to use yet. Because uh, in Undertale, you had to um, switch out your items with the dimensional boxes or whatever in order to have them in your in inventory. But now they just get sent straight to the box, so that's cool. Oh, wow. I'm, I'm just a block. Did we talk to everyone in the party dojo? No, we didn't. Hey, boss, boss, hey. <laughs> I'm so glad to have a nice boss I could shed a tear. But I won't. I'm on the job. I'll cry at home with the kids. Boss, you're strong, but there's always time to learn. The next step after tutorials is training. So me and the boys got you got you together a dojo. Complete our battle challenges and get some fabulous prizes. Meanwhile, you might get a little bit tougher. We're going to make you the strongest boss. Challenge. Jigsaw Joe. Joe's life savings. Learn how to spare like a champ. Raise challenge one. Gain, get 100% TP without getting hit. You can do it, boss. It's not Clover's birthday anymore. She won't go easy on you now. Uh, okay. I'm battle pass. Ask me about battles. Raising. When sh okay, so, alright. When shots aim direct. When shots aim directly, try to move slow. They aim where you were, not where you go. Interesting. Take the advantage and move bit by bit. You'll gain TP, but you won't get hit. Well, that's cool. 
So that is what grazing meant. Alright. Um, hole. We reached our monthly funding goal. I will now talk about our hole. It was dark, filled with darker dollars. Fed from subscription by our followers. Working hard, no bank, no lender. We received one unit of legal tender. Thanks for donating. <laughs> Shots aren't always as they appear. The bigger they are, the less to fear. You're, you'll only get hurt a little inside. Take your pride and learn the size. Got it. So the bigger the white bullet thingies that it, we get hit by, the less damage they do, ironically. All right. <laughs> Looks like fighting wasn't in the cards for us. Lucky for you, just hope you don't meet my friends. Finally, we don't show for people that are normal shaped. I will train myself for the tournament. To bed for three people. Or one three hundred. Yeah. Wow, our house is a dodo. Makes me want to fight. Can we go to sleep? <laughs> Should I do the dodo stuff? Yeah, let's do it. Alright. Boss! You can act and spare on the same turn. If you know Chris's act will give an enemy 100% mercy, spare them on the same turn with Susie or else in. Jigsaw Joe jigs in. Dicks out Joe's double. Susie spared Dicks out Joe. Or else they spared Dicks out Joe. Oh, boss, you're sparing me. Wait a second, I got something else to remind you of. Boss, it works the same way with making an enemy tired. If an act will make an enemy tired, use Ralph's pacify right or pacify right away. Of course, pacify is magic, so you'll need TP. Spending an Spend a turn defending to gain TP if you have to, boss. Jigsaw Joe looks like he could use a bedtime story. Sleepy story. <laughs> Susie told the enemy a bedtime story about beating them up. The enemy became tired. That sounds a little exciting. Jigsaw Joe drank coffee. Jigsaw Joe stopped being tired. Boss, you, you're putting me to sleep. I mean, you aren't. Make me tired and pacify me, boss. He needs a bedtime story. What the heck? What am I supposed to do? Get it, boss. If you can manage to spare enemies right away, battles will go a lot faster. That's all. Oh, thanks, buddy. An amazing battle. As promised, here's your reward. You received Joe's life savings. One dollar. Wow, I'm rich. Hey, boss. How can I help you? Let's do the next challenge. This time we'll get a hundred dollars. All right. If we can beat it. Graze. Damn it. Boss, for bullets aimed right at you, try moving one direction bit by bit. Huh.
I was expecting it to go faster. I'll try it again later. Maybe. Hey, welcome, Kalas. Hmm, so we are now in the castle town. Well, that all makes no difference to me. As long as I stay in my shop, these walls won't change. But, in a way, I suppose it's just a little bit amusing to see you again. I'm sure you three will have an interesting journey. Me? I'll just be here offering the same old junk. As you find stronger treasure, I'm sure you'll have little reason to return here. But if you have some time, I'll offer you this getting a hit. Hmm. The little prince has something to show you in this castle. Well then, are you going to turn down the royal invitation? Here again, or not? Uh, wait, what did he say? Shit. Good amigas, welcome to the bakery. I wish. Aw, oh, man. I didn't read what he said. I thought he would repeat himself. Poo poo. As long as the purple girl is by your side, there will be no prizes for more. Mamma mia. Who cares? Rossi can make me a cake. But, but my youngies, as a baker, don't, don't worry. Mind my pastries. Uh, don't worry. Mind my pastries. Don't, don't mind my pastries. Don't mind my pastries. A, a little extra salty today, everyone. Okay. What? Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm really freaking tired. <laughs> if you can't tell by how much I've been yawning, which is kind of normal for me, but whatever. Sure, it's great to be here with my best friend, Hathi. Hathi seems fine. Hey, boss, I'll have a dark candy starfay. Lemonade, please. Jukebox is broken. Feels like you might never have to find a working one. Uh, all right. So that was Cafe O.P. It's a bit scary moving to a new place, but as of all, there's nothing to fear except sphere spell, sphere itself. Uh, what? Come on. Prince Ralsei, I will keep your hat erect until you need it. <laughs> Just wanted to show off your huge house, huh? No, what I want to show you is upstairs. Oh, I remember this place. Okay. Living quarters. He's on the second floor. Basement floor. Living quarters for bad guys. Alright. Door is locked. Guess we'll go upstairs. Oh, uh, I was surprised for you two. I made rooms for you in the castle. Rooms? So you can stay here whenever you want. Um, I'd be happy if this place could be like a second home to you. A place that you can go no matter what's happening outside. Well, we'll take a look. It's a wardrobe full of all sorts of different clothes. You could wear whatever you want. It's a shelf. All sorts of keepsakes could be put here. It's a stand for your manual. I thought you might want to keep it here in case you want to read it. It's your bed. It feels incredibly soft, like sleeping on a dream. Wow. 
we get meta there? Is this a dream? Dun dun dun. Who knows? Who cares? This is fun. Either way. Hey, Rose, what's up here? Well, oh, just some more rooms I'm renovating. So, is your room up there? Uh, yes, I still um, haven't dusted it though. Yeah, but like we need to see your nerdy glasses collection anyway. Hang on one second. Sorry, skip it forward. I need to. better than I remember. I even have my own bed now. Now I don't have to sleep in a hole anymore. Oh, I thought you already had a bed. No, that was for the bike. This is the best room ever. How do you like, how do you know what I like? Er, uh, I just sort of had a hunch. The Quasimodo of kindness, people. I love that my floor is full of holes. <laughs> It's a homemade recreationally. We found 20 rupees in the hole. Unfortunately, that's not a useful currency here. Okay, so they say the same thing. This is the last hole place it. Okay, this must be Susie's room. Oh boy, here we go. And Susie, this is your room. Um, I tried to make it something you'd like, but you can put anything else you want in here too. I really hope you like it. I guess that's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. My own room, like this. Mm -hmm. How long did it uh, take you to do this? Well, er, since I last saw you two, I... Man, you're a real weenie, you know that? <laughs> I think she likes it, Chris. <laughs> Jealous, I got the cool room. Look, Chris. Cool, spike bed. Now I can stab myself during the night. Finally, some convenience. <laughs> Damn, there's everything in here. Pine cones, chalk, moss, jars of salsa, pieces of ice, black crumbs from the toaster, jawbreakers. Oh, and like actual food too. Awesome. Susie, you didn't get to read the manual, so I put it over here for you. Cool, I'll read it before bed. That'll put me to sleep. <laughs> It's a clothes drawer full of spiky and dangerous clothing. All the clothes are ripping each other up into shreds. Hell yeah, jealous Chris? <laughs> this is awesome. Alright, so I think we're done here. We can... So, what do we do now? Feel free to explore the town until you're ready to leave. Eh, like we're gonna leave right now, right Chris? Like we're gonna leave now, right Chris? I, I don't know. Oh, I nearly forgot. This is where I cook. You cook everything in a giant witch's pot? Of course. Cauldron cooking is very convenient. Here, Chris. Susie, have a cake. <laughs> it just explodes outside. She's the whole thing. Hmm, a little thick on the frosting. The, those were sharing. Hey, anyone was free to make an interception. Hey, anyone was free to make an interception. There we go. That's the delivery. Ha <laughs> ha. DF. Oh yeah, the basement floor. Got it. It's violently protecting the jail. We're still behind bars for some reason, but it's okay. We've grown to love this hellish place where we dress as animals. We decided to dress as kings. It's cultural exchange. Nice. Oh look, it's Dad. What's up, Dad? How do I do this voice again? Oh, the lightners. Have you come to humiliate me? Hell yeah. No. 
you, Mr. King. The light has returned everyone here safely. If you're willing to reconsider, then... What? Live in a kingdom ruled by you? The light is little patsy? Staying in this cell is far less humiliating. Now if you'll excuse me, my giant hamster wheel is getting cold. By the way, is my son happy? Like you care? Like you care? You were gonna throw him off a cliff! Aw, uh, bring your prejudice. Aw, oh, your prejudice made my bluff too effective, I see. Besides, even if I could, if, even if I threw him, he would just bounce. My son is a bouncy little pumpkin. Aw, oh, cute. Er, oh, cute. We're done talking to you. Sorry, I read, aw, oh, cute, and I was thinking I was supposed to do Susie's voice for a second. I thought she was the one that said it. The castle town has transformed from the power of friendship. We are filled with the power of friendship. Yeah, we already read that. Okay, so we explored the town. Kind of. There's more stuff this way, apparently. And to the left, probably. Oh, it's quite a wonderful town, really. Thank you. So why am I alone here? A bit of self-reflection, I suppose. I do realize I was quite a coward before, so I wanted to say, well, I still am. My cards, I cannot handle society. For now, I'll be living at the top of this cliff. When I'm ready to meet society again, I will be back. Thank you. Thank you for the wonderful home. I will not use it. Okay. There's a hole in the wall. There's nothing inside. Hmm. Interesting. Mr. Society left, didn't he? Hmm. I reckon I knew this wouldn't happen. It's not in your it's not in no fault of yours. He'll be back one day. Well trees, I must gain nutrients by eating clothes. Such as the way of the worm. Looks like the clothes are nibbled. Take a bite. Sure! You put your mouth against the mannequin's cheek. Cruz? Don't bother, it tastes awful. Ew, Susie? <laughs> hilarious. Hilarious. Absolutely hilarious, my friends. Oh boy. Alright, let's go south, see if there's anything down there. <laughs> Nothing. Wait, Chris, we're leaving? Well, we just got here. Man, I don't want to go to our group, group project. Oh, you two have homework? Uh, well... Susie, Chris, you ought to do it right away. School's important. I banish you from this kingdom until you start your project. <sighs> Fine, I'll do it. Jeez. Susie, don't worry. I'll go and help you, too. Or, wait, let's or perhaps you should... Too late, king kind boy. Friendship for me. Uh, Lancer was added to your key items. What? Where'd you go? Don't worry, I just entered your inventory. I'll just be hanging out in Chris's pocket. Don't know what that means, but okay. Fear not. I too shall assist if. Uh, we're good. Aha, uh -huh, quite. We, as a team, are good. Ruxels became a key item, even though no one wanted that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. All right, enough already. Let's get going. Good luck today, Chris. See you soon. Uh, can I just come back when you finish your homework? What's the point of having a room if you can't slack off in it? Oh man, can we save in the light world? Because I haven't seen any save points up here yet. I wanted to like end the episode around now because I want to go to bed, but I guess we'll keep going. Okay. Well, oh, damn. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Meta, because I want to go to sleep and you're saying that. Anyway. Well, damn. Guess, guess we, guess we gotta do our project. Sorry. See what I mean by Meta? Uh, just kidding. I love this. I love you guys. This game is great. Okay. At least we got an answer, right? Answer? Where are you? Damn, guess he skipped that after all, huh? Hmm, so where should we do this? 
What? The library? Oh, well, right. Uh... Uh, okay. Let's just go. Wait. Is there a library in the school? No, I don't think there is. Oh, there's the library. Well, this makes sense. And of course, this is the game's way of forcing you to go to the library and not being able to go anywhere else. That's freaking awesome, actually. I love this. Traffic's moving at snails at a snail's pace. I love snails. Could today get any better? I heard a dog was doing donuts, so I sped over here. But I just learned donuts is actually the name of a special attack for cars. Why is my life stuck in a loop of doughy disappointment? Damn. I was just directing traffic as normal when a little when a little dog drove up when a little dog drove one of those toy cars into the middle of the street and started doing donuts. In the chaos, all the cars in town got jammed up. Thankfully, no one was hurt, but ordinary citizens like you gotta get out of here. I've got some heavy lifting to do. Yeah, of course. All right, we're here. School. Goddamn project. Books? God damn crazy about them. Hey, Chris, where the hell is everybody? Something seems kind of off. Screw it, let's just go play... Screw it, let's just go play Space Pinball in the computer lab. Uh, huh? It's like... The inside of the closet? Yes, you have to think this could be... Oh, I guess we're both gonna go into another dark world? Well, I guess this means we can't start our project. Unless... You know, Chris? There's a dark fountain in there. You can seal it. And it'll turn back into the computer lab, right? So what's it gonna be, Chris? Let's go, let's go. We can use the computer at my house. Yeah, let's just drop the act. Our last adventure was great, right? I couldn't stop thinking about having another. I don't know what's in there, but we can't live if we don't find out, right? Come on, Chris. Whee! Adventure time! It's a random dark hole of who knows what the fuck's gonna happen this. Oh, we get the same clothes, so I guess it won't be that bad. Maybe I spoke too soon. This is new. Oh, I can move. Okay. Hey, a save point. But I want to keep playing now. Damn it. <laughs> oh, well, let's just keep going. The wires. The wires. Uh. Oh, no. Okay, this is how. Okay. Oh, I want to see what this is. Never mind. Alright. Oh, these are the help us not get hit by the thingamajiggies that are trying to attack us. Got it. Alright, let's go. Oh, come on. You couldn't stretch. You really needed to stretch that far out. Poo poo sticks. Everyone was. Everyone else has been. Save us. She's going. Oh, fuck. Somebody help me. Somebody, please. Susie? Cool that you're here. Just... Wait. Get out of here before it's too late. Noel! Noel of the city, Susie. Who the hell are you? Oh, I'm known as serial number Q5U4EX7YY2E9N. But you, but you foolish children may call me... Queen. <laughs> like we're gonna call you Queen. Q5U37, uh... Queen. Well, look, Queen, we're not children. 
teens are really big children, and adults are even bigger children. Stupid. Big stupid. <laughs> Doesn't that make you a child too then? No, I am a computer, which means smart. It, is, it says nice on her face. <laughs> computer? Well, thank you for the stimuli, but I must leave now. Goodbye. <laughs> wait, wait. Why do you capture Noel? I would have captured you too, but I ran out of cages. <laughs> Why the capturing? So that, me, so that she may become my willing peon in my quest for world domination. Also, maybe I will make her face into a robot one? <laughs> what? Why? Seems cool. <laughs> well, forget it, dude. <laughs> Nobody's turning anyone's face into a robot. Could be that a statement of an animus dissension. <laughs> Could that be a statement of animus dissension? That's what she said. Huh? You wanna, you wanna fight, loser? <laughs> yes, yes already, yes! Oh, and bye. Wait. Wait a goddamn second. Wait a goddamn second. I have no time for such frivolities and would kick your ass. But perhaps someone else can entertain you. Ah, oh, shit. Enjoy your assimilation. Where wire swung in. Let me see. Toss Chris to free wire. Okay. Chris wire to throw, aim for the weak point. Shit. The wire greatly loosened. Awesome. Alright, time for some bullet hell. Oh, got some TP. I wish Ralsei was here. He's so useful. The atmosphere is electric. Okay. Oh, they're both tired. Can we put them to sleep? No. Alright, I guess we gotta rescue them from the wires anyway. Oh, uh, fuck. No, not you. The other one. Well, I guess it'll hit either one either way, because that's what. Yeah, I chose the opposite before and it got to the other one, so. Whatever. Yeah, okay. You diddled your body. The wire loosened in turn. Susie spared wear wire. Oh, we got a recruit. Sweet. Oh, it, oh, I need to save six of them to recruit them. Okay. That's what that one out of six meant. The atmosphere is electric. Two. 176 bucks, hell yeah. Phew, nice fighting again after so long. Now let's go catch up to Queen. Oh shit. Or not? Huh, to calm down? Or just use my pacify spell to put them into sleep mode. Yay, it's Ralsei! I was hoping to. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy right now. Oof, so good to see you, buddy. Ralsei, you're here! I felt a dark presence and hurried over. It seems that a new dark fountain has appeared. Mm -hmm. Elsie, they got Noel. Mm -hmm. Damn, what was she thinking messing in our dark world? Mm -hmm. If we don't do something, she might be... Worry not, Susie. All that we have to do is seal the fountain. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Can't be mad about another adventure, right? Mm -hmm. Come on, Chris. Hells yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go. The fun gang is at it again. Oh, what the hell is this? Uh, am I supposed to catch those or avoid them? Avoid them. Got it. 
Whoa, that's beautiful. Holy shit. That's fucking awesome. Uh, can I save? I'm pressing the wrong button, aren't I? The green field extends before you, and in the, si in the distance, the city shines brightly. You are filled with the power of a new adventure. And you know what? I think I'm gonna end this here just to like add a little bit of suspense and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next video. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Deltarune with me and I love you guys. Uh, hold on, I gotta fucking bloopity bloopity blah. This game, when I press my windows key on this game, it doesn't just take me to my desktop, it just goes through, yeah, but that's okay. I've had that experience before. There's an easy fix for it, and I'm there now. So, anyways, have a great.